think I just looked at that one. Book of Symbols. Ah, great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. All right, Buffkin, what you got? Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Buffkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? You're reading it upside probably down. probably wrote this in himself. <laughs> this looks familiar. Yes, from the Acts of the Woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone bless that thing. I only translate. <laughs> Ooh. What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Not quite who I'm looking for. Hey, there's that ring. Right up here. Huh. Nothing else. What's it say about that? It says brickle bit in an older elvish hand. What's brickle bit? My magic word. What's it do? It makes animals shit gold. <laughs> <laughs> brickle bit. That's funny. Uh -huh. This is the one. Where's this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alelirao? I'll go look it up. Alelirao. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin. Also known as <laughs> ass skin. <laughs> prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Hmm. Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Oh, his hmm. daughter, Faith. Hmm. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. Hmm. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? That's yes. strangely incestuous. Please. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Don't yeah. Her scared. name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. Oh, Faith. You should talk to the husband. You think he did it? Hmm. Nothing would surprise me at this point. We can't rule him out. Huh. That sucks. Anything more? I think, I think we're done? I mean... Ah, there we go. You know what this means? Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stock in its wisdom, Bigby. Hmm. Not when you've been so helpful. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear as a window. Right. Maybe this Prince Lawrence guy? Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. Of which fable do you wish to know? Blah, blah. Yeah. Ooh, Show okay. me Faith's father, the old king. Oh. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. 
He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Hmm. What's he been doing? Is that Keds? Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Huh. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Show me... Show me faith. Through powerful magic her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Bigby. It's simply the way this has to be. Interesting. Nobody right now. Anything we can say use? that? Yeah. That'll have to do for now. Come on. We're going over there. Mm. Sorry. I have to get that. Mm -hmm. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes? I... He is? Hold on. Bigby. It's for you. <laughs> of course. Bigby! It's me. Hello. You there? Toad, got your glamour yet? Yeah, 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 it's fine. Big B, shit. Listen, right, there's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait, hang on. Boy, shit. Hey! What was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What oh, about no. Faith's husband? Is Toad I dead? Know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search her apartment. Toad might have to wait. Whenever you're ready. I'm ready. Red Eye! Woo! Eye Crane. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. Hmm. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Hmm. Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Toad's apartment. That seems Toad more, sounds uh, like he needs help right now. Yeah. We can check in on Prince Lawrence after. Yeah. Okay. I'm not looking forward to breaking the news to him anyway. Bullfinch Street? Glass Slipper. <laughs> oh boy. And we ended up going out the window and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. Toad's apartment. Looks worse in the day. <laughs> yeah, it does. Damn. Is somebody up there? Hey! Hmm. Wait here. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, what? The door? I see a door. Bathroom. Shit. I shouldn't have said anything. I'm sorry! That's enough, all right? Just shut it! <laughs> I don't even remember half of this shit. <laughs> Colin doesn't make this much of a mess. <laughs> Anything over here? Yeah, there was this. What kind of asshole swings a lamp at a guy? Yeah, really. Asshole. A big hole in the wall. <laughs> well, that's where we went over. Yeah, yeah. Bed. Yeah, 
got nothing over here. Toad's house. Uh oh. Oh man. Did somebody kill Toad. That's the last He's, thing. That is son. Toads? I think. Be nice in there, okay? Mm. Hey Toad! You in there? Bigby! Oh. And Miss White! Surely you didn't come all this way uh. just for my bother. Uh-huh. Okay, Toad, what you had? Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. Hmm. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. What's going on? What do you mean? Nothing's going on, Big B. I don't know what you mean. Truly. False alarm is all. Sorry. Bullshit. Bullshit. <clears throat> Are you all right? He's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Stung. So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. But it was nothing, really. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Whew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Uh... Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? <laughs> Look at his feet. It has a weevil. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. While you're looking for nothing. 